Barbara Boxer is talking to a uh, member of the military here, a military officer, and he's testifying before her, and she stops him in mid-sentence uh, to make uh, a correction. Hmm, let's watch. Well, why has it been delayed? Uh, Ma'am, at the uh, LACPR is... It, a, you know, do me a favor. Could you say Senator instead of Ma'am? <laughs> yes, it's sir. just a thing. I worked so hard to get that title, so I'd appreciate it. Yes, thank you. Yes, Senator. Uh-oh. Boxer regulating on his ass. All right, now this is obviously a bit of a controversy. Uh, should she have done that or not? Uh, we're going to have to bring in some uh, folks. Uh, we're going to bring on our female correspondent first, uh, Anna Kasparian. Um, Anna, I don't know if you knew you were our female correspondent, but you just officially got that title. Congratulations. Well, I'm the only female here, so that would make sense. Oh, is that why? Well, you know, we were thinking of going with someone else. But all right, you win. You win. <laughs> it's you. Um, as soon as she said it, I said, I love that shit. Oh, really? Yeah, as soon as she said it. Huh, that's an she interesting... Deser she deserves that respect. She's a senator. The males okay. are senators. They should be considered senators and called senators. It's... Uh, but what's wrong with ma'am? Is ma'am a wrong, bad word? I don't think ma'am. I don't, look, I don't know how all of these uh, meetings work and how they refer to each other, but I don't hear the male senators referring to each other as sir. Mm -hmm. They refer to each other as Senator Feingold, you know, whatever. But all right, she's all right. a senator, so why don't you refer to her as a senator? That's interesting. Uh, although these military guys are very used to saying sir and ma'am. So mm -hmm. uh, let's bring in a different view, and I'm not sure which way he's going to go here. Uh, J.R. Jackson. Uh, is uh, ma'am wrong? Is senator the right way to go? What's your thoughts here? Um, I, I don't really don't get it. Uh, it's, it's one of those things where, oh, by the way, ma'am is fine. Mm -hmm. Shut up and continue the hearing, please. Stop with the idiot. You know, you know, you know. I, I really don't want to answer my question. I'd rather you just call me senator. Why? Because you're not a ma'am. Anyway, it sounds like you know people make fun of of douchebags when they say, oh, "Excuse me, no, it's not Mister, it's Doctor Robinson." Oh, those those guys are the best. I didn't go to school for all this time to be called Mister. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> hey, J please. From now on, every time you mention my name, JD, please. I didn't go to school all that time not to be called JD, okay? Although I don't think... I mean, this thing, and I mean, that's how it works. The thing is, I can understand it if he was saying it, and you can tell he's being derogatory. Like, if he's an idiot talk show guy who's just trying to get a, a rise out of somebody, and he says, well, ma'am, ma'am, or trying to do something like that, then maybe you call him out for being an idiot. But there was no sense of disrespect right there when he said so, that So, man, we got very disparate opinions here from Justice Jackson and Justice Kasparian. Uh, and, that, you know, I read that really great uh, study about how if there's a woman on the court, they will influence the other people on the court, the other judges on the court, to rule more in favor of women's rights on uh, specific court cases. It's a really fascinating study. Uh, it has not worked in this case. <laughs> and I gave her opinion, and JR came out completely the opposite side. Anyway, I'm a little torn on it. I think the military guys say sir and ma'am. On the other hand, I, I couldn't tell if she, he was in any way trying to be disrespectful. And, uh, you know, my, the thing that occurred to me is when she said, I worked hard for that title, I thought, yeah, you know, I, I know politicians, and it's a curious way of working hard to get that title. But nonetheless, she did. She did, and she's not a bad politician. She's one of the better ones. So we're going to have to go to the Chief Justice here to straighten things out. Uh, should she have stopped the proceedings to say, hey, call me Senator? No, not in front of everybody. I think... Maybe after privately she mentions it, but like to make it so out there in front of everybody and put the guy on blast, I don't, I don't think it's cool. <laughs> it's not cool to put the guy on blast. Yeah. Okay, I hear you. Um, you know, it, it, the problem is I can't rule on it. it. We need more context because there's some chance that guy was getting on her last nerve. And then if she, because I'm not sure she pulls that trigger unless she's felt like, hey, I got disrespected earlier. Uh, for something, and I'm tired of this guy with his man bullshit, right? Uh, if that's the case, then I'm going with Boxer, but if it's just a out of nowhere, then I hear you, Senator Boxer, but just give me a little bit of a chill pill. You need to bring it down a little bit.